In this video, we are going to learn how to measure the lines and the pony lines in CAD reader. To measure the distance between two points, we have two features. Under the measure, we have aligned and linear. We can use the aligned to measure the straight distance between two points. Left click to select the first point. Left click to select the second point. Then we get the straight distance. Left click to put the result. When we want to measure the perpendicular distance between two points, we can use the linear. Select the two points again. Now we can get the horizontal distance or the vertical distance between the two points. Left click to put the result. So this is the difference between aligned and linear. Let's see how to measure the lengths of pony lines, including arcs. Under the measure category, select continuous measure. Then left click to select the end point of the line. When it comes to an arc, your cursor becomes a little white square, which means this is an arc and can be selected. If you select something wrong, you can press the space button on your keyboard to take a step back and then continue to select the right lines. Right click to finish then you get the nouns of the pony line. Then we can use the section nouns to view the nouns of each section. Left click on the result we just got. See, we can view the nouns of those sections. An important tip here, make sure you select the continuous sections Otherwise, it might pop out a hint. Please select a continuous lines. This is because there is a gap between the sections. So we can zoom in and select this end point to make the lines connected. Another useful tip is that we can interrupt the arc if we think it is too long. For example, here if we want to measure the length of this part. Using the continuous measure, select the first point, then CAD reader automatically detects and selects the arc. However, we did not want to select the entire arc. So we can move the mouse and find the point of intersection where you want to interrupt the arc and left click on it. Then we can only keep the session we want. So we can continue and get the nouns of this part.